Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on relative frequency. The frequency of a score tells you how often that score occurs in a set of scores. The relative frequency tells you the fraction or percentage of the total number of scores represented by that score. Let's have a look at example 1 to see how relative frequency works. Consider the following scores. So here we have 20 scores. We've been asked to place the above scores in a frequency distribution table and find the relative frequency for each score. So in order to calculate the relative frequency, we have frequency over total frequency. So the above can be expressed as a fraction, decimal or percentages. So let's have a look at this example which will explain it fully. The score represented by X will be 4567896. Six separate scores. This is the frequency for each of those scores. Now the relative frequency of the score 4 will be 3 over 20. Okay, 3 over 20. Now to express that as a decimal, it's 0 0.15. That's quite easy to do with a calculator. Just go 3 division 20 equals, and that gives you 0 0.15. For the score of 5, the frequency is 5. So the relative frequency is 0 0.25, which is 5 over 20. For the score of 6, the frequency is 4, so the relative frequency is 0 0.20, and so on. These relative frequency are easy to calculate. Just use your calculator and put frequency over total frequency. Now notice here I've expressed the relative frequencies as a decimal, but as I said, you can express them as a fraction or a percentage. Let's have a look at some simple questions now on this particular table. We can now answer some questions from the table. What is the relative frequency of the score 6? So that's the first question. So we go back to the table and we see that the relative frequency of the score 6 is 0 0.2. Let's have a look at the next question. Express this answer as a percentage. Well, 0 0.2, we've seen in earlier videos, especially in Year 9 lessons, which we have. So you can find the Year 9 lessons on my channel. The 0 0.2, all you do is multiply that by 100. So to change the decimal to a percentage, multiply it by 100, and that gives you 20%. What does the relative frequency of 20% mean for the score of 6. Okay, so the relative frequency for the score of 6 is 20%. Now what does it actually mean? It means that the score of 6 makes up 20% of the total number of scores. Express the relative frequency for the score of 6 as a fraction. 20% means 20 over 100. We know that. When you have percentage, that means out of 100. When you simplify that, you get 1 over 5. What is the total sum of the relative frequencies? The total sum is always 1. For the above question, what does answer 1 mean? So what is actually, what is the meaning of this? This is the answer. It means that we have accounted for 100% of the scores. So this video has introduced us to the idea of relative frequency and we've seen how to calculate relative frequency from a frequency distribution table and we've also answered some basic questions.